So Bowery is the modern farming company, and we build large-scale commercial farms. Right. We grow completely indoors in a controlled environment, vertically stacked. And so, first of all, that means we can grow 365 days of the year, totally independent of weather and seasonality. But we grow pesticide-free, agrochemical-free food. We're over 100 times more productive than that same square footage of farmland, and we save 95% of the water when we grow. And who are you selling to right now? So we sell the wholesalers primarily, so okay. retailers like Whole Foods in the tri-state area, other stores here in New York, and then some restaurants as well. And how many farms, or should I call them facilities, I don't know what, how you describe they are them. Farms. They're farms. We are growing food, so they're very much farms. How many do you have at this point? So we have one farm now, and right. we're at work on our next farm here in the tri-state area as well. It, it, is this something that's possible only because so many people are looking for locally sourced organic food these days? I mean, that, that's something buyers are willing to pay a premium. So what's great about this is the product itself is actually priced at or below the cost of similar field products. Really? So it's a better... Well, when you say similar field, what's that? So organic products. Okay. And so you're already getting a better product at a price that's at or cheaper than what organics are coming from the field. And because our farms are right close to the point of consumption in the cities, the time between hard Harvest and consumption for a Bowery product is about a day versus a traditional farm, which could be two to three weeks. To get things into the yeah, just to areas. get things from wherever they are back to where where we're actually. One of the biggest them. challenges with this has yep. always been the cost of electricity for lighting. Yes. So how have you solved that? So this is actually what is exciting for us. One of the things that makes this business possible is it was about six or seven years ago that the cost structure around LED lighting completely changed. So you saw the cost of LED fixtures drop by over 85%. And at the same time, the efficiency of the fixture is more than doubled. So for years, research labs, the universities, NASA, the government, they've been using lights to grow food and other things indoors. It just didn't make any economic sense. Just recently, that flipped and changed. And so you can now build a profitable business. Right. You look out five years, um, how many of these farms do you want to build? How close to cities can you get? So we can be as close to a city as we really want to be. And ultimately, it, it doesn't make sense to be right over here in Times Square necessarily. Right. You can be 10 miles away, 20 miles away, and you're still much, much closer that, than most farms ultimately are. Our view is to see our farms in as many cities around the country and around the world as possible because ultimately the problem of how do you provide fresh food to urban environments and how do you do it more efficiently and more sustainably right. is one that not only exists in this country but around the world. How do you differentiate yourself? And the reason I ask is there are others, yep. dare I say, that are doing what you're doing. Yep. So we have a really large focus both on automation and robotic technology in the farms as well as on the software side. So we've built what we call the Bowery Operating System and it is the brains of our farm. It's taking in millions of points of data. We have a computer vision system with machine learning algorithms that can look at plants and understand what's happening with these plants, analyze all this data in real time and then make how many, changes. How many in employees do you have relative to what a traditional farm might have? So we can be much more efficient than a traditional farm because a lot of what we're doing can be done through automation, can be done through the software itself. And when we, we also are running our farms year round consistently. So a farm may staff up really quickly around harvest time and then it'll shut back down again. We have a consistent base of employees which are sort of always there because our farm's always running. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.